morning. Good morning from Bethlehem, New Hampshire. Just be is their slogan. I'll show you that before I leave. I'm gonna go into this little cafe. It's super cute. Um, seems like they really try and cater to remote workers, so fingers crossed that their Wi-Fi is strong and I can... St I'm still kind of experiencing some of those phone issues, but I'm hoping that I can resolve everything today. So, um, yeah, and then after that I will do a hike in the area, but the hike that I wanted to do, I was like looking at the photos and there's just like way too many people and I'm not interested in going around that many people for a hike. It's like part of part of the reason you want to be on a hike is to like have that level of solitude. Oh man, I always forget about that air conditioner. I wonder if it's too loud. But part of the reason you want to like hike is to get that solitude. So it's better when there's fewer people out on the trail. But, um, yeah, don't know where I'm gonna go yet. I'll find out, hopefully, you know. sure look delicious. Just keeps getting sweeter and sweeter. Today we are hiking the Mount Pemiguasa. I want to say that's how it's pronounced. What's probably wrong. Um, hiking up there. I did this trail back in 2019 on my original road trip through this area. Um, but it had like spring foliage and now it's got the fall colors and so I'm really excited to go out there and just see what the trail looks like under different conditions. It's gonna be really, really nice. I'm really excited about it. And then the rain will start um, pretty shortly after I finish this trail. I would assume it's gonna start early afternoon. It's about noon now. So um, the trail is expected to take about two hours. So I should be finishing up just in time, and then I'm gonna head a little tiny bit south back towards the border of Vermont and New Hampshire, and tomorrow I'm gonna have coffee with a friend. So it's gonna be a very another lovely day. I love coming places that I've been before. It's so fun. All right, into the nature.
pretty colors. Beautiful. Oh my god. That's all I can say. It's probably annoying. The way down is looking pretty good though. Also. <laughs> Almost there. This hike is 1,200 feet-ish of elevation gain and just under three and a half miles. Finally at the top, it looks so different up here. We made it. It's packed. There's tons of people here. So I took a picture here last time. Standing between these two trees. I remember finding a John Muir quote for it. I'm just a girl. <laughs> It's starting to rain. It's actually ice. I could stay up here all day. I've been enjoying finding leaves that like match the gradient of the forest. I feel like this one kind of hits it. Definitely a trail you gotta take slow. Definitely don't wanna roll my ankle again like I did up near San Francisco. Oops, you can still, you can start to hear the road now. Almost back.
that hike was just as beautiful as I remember it. Um, absolutely stunning colors everywhere. It is a little bit past the peak. I think that's pretty obvious, but, um, nonetheless, still absolutely beautiful. So, um, I think I'm going to get going now. I don't really know where I'm going from here. I think I'm going to head down south towards this little place called Lebanon. I, I don't know if it's technically New Hampshire or Vermont, but that's the direction I'm going next. See you there. Massage chairs are amazing. Getting nice and cozy in here. Tis the season. So the gym closes early because it's the weekend. It's usually 24 seven, but some places it's 24 five. And then they do this weird thing on the weekend where it's like not open 24 hours and they close for a few hours at night. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna come back in the morning and shower and then, and then I will be going to meet up with a girl that I met on the PCT. And then after that, I'm going to Maine. So. I am going to call it a night, find a nice local spot to uh, relax and sleep, and then we'll be back here in the morning. Good night. It is an absolutely beautiful rainy morning. It's not heavy rain, it's kind of more of a drizzle. But it's very, very nice. Um, heading into the gym, taking a quick shower, and then going to visit with my friend. Just like that, back in Vermont. So much bread. That's all you're gonna see of the lighthouse. They're actively kicking people out. <laughs> Mm, 
my goal is to do Acadia National Park all day tomorrow. So I still have like a three hour drive to get there. Um, I'm gonna drive two hours and, or it's a little, a little less than two hours and stop in Bangor, Maine. And then um, tomorrow morning I'll do the drive to um, Acadia. So that's the plan right now. And maybe after that, I'll just come back through this way.